Yeah, welcome to another session of Sam's Economics Tutorials. And in today's video, I'm going to be discussing the exceptional demand curves. In our previous video, we were discussing the uh, we were discussing reasons why the demand curve slopes downward. So today we are going to discuss, we are going to look at a video that is a contradiction to the law of demand. So uh, we we are going to look at it in two aspects. The first case where demand where quantity demanded falls as price falls, and the second case where quantity demanded increases as price increases. So this is just a contradiction to the law of demand. The law of demand which uh, states that quantity demanded increases as price falls and falls as price increases. But this case today is a different case, is a contradiction to the law of demand. So let's start with the first case where uh, price uh, falls and quantity demanded also falls. So the demand curve for this uh, of goods is is regressive at the bottom. This means that the quantity demanded falls as price falls. So let's take the example. Uh, we take uh, this is a case with uh, different goods. Different goods are a special type of inferior falls and their quantity demanded also falls. Goods are said to be different depending on the community. We can explain using this graph. So when prices fall from P0 to P1, the quantity demanded also fall from Q to Q1. So that's for given goods. And we show they show a uh, exceptional case with the law of demand. So we take uh, when uh, the second case, when consumers are expecting a future fall in price they will reduce their quantity demanded because they know that in future prices are going to be falling and they will purchase at that time. So their quantity demanded falls from Q0 to Q1 as price falls from P0 to P1. So we now look at another case, the second case where price increases and quantity demanded also increases. So with this one, with this type of a graph, the demand curve is a regressive at the top this means that as price increases, the quantity demanded also increases. So this is a case with goods of ostentation. Goods of ostentation are also called Veblen goods. And these are the type of prestigious goods that people buy to displace their wealth. As price increases from P0 to P1, the quantity demanded also Q0 to Q1. The second one, when consumers are expecting a future increase in price they will need to buy more even if even when prices are increasing they need to buy more because they are expecting that prices will increase in future this is shown on the graph where price increases from p0 to p1 quantity demanded also increases from q0 to q1 so thank you for this uh, video of today and uh, in our previous video we we're looking at the law of demand and reasons why the demand curve slopes downward but with this case today it, it is a contradiction or abnormal demand curve it is a contradiction to the law of demand too so see you in our next video please try to subscribe to my channel on youtube ring the notification bell to get most of my video whenever i upload